not very good news for British um, land. Uh, this is an article from the Telegraph Financial. Um, it says British land reports one billion loss as the value of its portfolio slumps. Um, a shift to online shopping has seen the valuation of its retail arm fall 26% with a further hit to be expected. So um, the value of its assets have dropped and I've got some shares in British land as you can see on my trading one to one platform. Uh, I've got, um, let's go back, um, I've got 7.3 shares. The value now is 29.71 and it's down 16 pounds and tuppence, which is 35% since I bought them. So, as you say, British land are not doing too well at the moment. Um, over a year, they've um, uh, dropped 35%. So, I think my value of my British land shares is about as bad as it's been in a year. Um, so I'll be buying no more British land, uh, but when they start to um, come round again, which hopefully they will, I will sell. But I don't think there's much of a long term future for British land because, as I say, they invest in um, shopping centres where people are getting away from going out shopping and um, office space. And um, due to the lockdown, and I think this will carry on, people are getting more used to working from home. So they may not be quite in so much demand. So when um, British land get up to where I purchased, I might um, realise what I've made on them and um, move on to another investment. So that's just a little bit um, of an update on one of my shares in my portfolio, British land. Uh, I wouldn't buy buy British land at the moment. I would sell, but I'm not going to sell just yet. I'm going to wait for the value of my shares to return to what I paid for them, then sell and think again of what I'm going to do. So to next time, I um, wish you um, a good day.